Hey, did you know that working out is only 10% of your fat loss equation? Yeah, I know. Amber Goodrich of the Eat Yourself Fit. I'm going to talk to you about the other 90% of the important equation that is often overlooked. Things like nutrition, because a calorie is not just a calorie. Don't let anybody tell you. Otherwise, don't let them lie to you. What you eat does indeed matter. And that plays a heavily role on things like hormones. Hormones matter, my friends, and hormones are heavily impacted by the things we eat. Hormones are also heavily impacted by the third thing that I want to talk about, which is sleep and stress management. You simply cannot be the best you without sleep. You've got to be rested. The best you is a rested you. That's a fact, Jack. That brings me to Oh man, one of the most important things that we can do for ourselves, and that is water. Water, water. Dehydration never does the body good. Water is such an important part to your fat loss journey. You actually cannot chemically lose any fat in your body without water. It's called lipolysis and it requires water to do fat breakdown. So if you are in a state of dehydration more often than not, then you are going to find yourself having a real hard time losing that little jub jub around the midsection. Drink your water. Drink. And last but not least, the part of that 90% that is often not talked about is increasing your NEAT. What is NEAT? It is non-exercise activity thermogenesis. So these are just our daily movements. Like moving your body throughout the day. It's like getting up to walk around to go to the bathroom or um, you know, taking the stairs instead of the elevator, right? It's just increasing your normal, non-strenuous, non-stressful movements to try to increase the body movement throughout the day. Did you know that it is far more beneficial for your health and fitness goals to make sure that you're increasing the amount that you move per day than it is, like go moving throughout the day, than it is to hit the gym really hard for an hour and then sit the rest of it. So there you have it. That's right. Your workout is only 10% of your fat loss equation. Until next time, you guys, eat more, eat well, eat happy. Bye.